Can I get a pastor there who wants to be anointed? Hey! 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 hey. Take it! You're anointed. You're anointed. Anointed does not enter you. You are taking it so cheap. And you don't know what happened to us. So, when you want to, you must be, your eyes must be open. You must be very serious. Okay, if now a man of God says, okay, come and get anointed, you must be very serious running with your eyes open. Can I get one person now? Yeah, this one. You, this one. This one. You can see what has happened to this brother. This one. He got, he's anointed, this one. He's anointed. Let me get here. A person wants to marry here. Stop there. Stop there. Bring this lady to me. Look at this brother. Look at this lady. You people who are, you will marry. And as, as we pass, as we pass. Can I get someone there who want to be anointed there? Brother, you have it. You. Look at this one. Can you see this? Can you see? Can you see this? Look at this one. Anointing is a very serious issue. It's like when the Bible talks about the pool of what? A Bethesda. Where you run, in, you enter inside. You must ask everybody who anointed. They didn't get it cheap. And now you want to be anointed? You, you, you do like this. You do like this. Anointing will never come to you. You must be, you know, like now when I'm telling you, if I say I want you to be a prophet, Amen. I mean, it can happen now, today. Amen. But it goes by, are you, you know, do you have that faith? Amen. Let's see the work. Amen. That's what I'm talking about. Amen. Do you have that faith? Let's see what? The work. Amen. Can I get someone here who's sick of HIV that side? HIV. Can you see this woman coming out without shame? Please, these two ladies must come forward. Stop there, you people. Stop there. Stop. Receive now. Take it. Take it. Take. Take healing in Jesus' name. Take healing. Take healing. Not long here, there's a lady here that was having HIV. And then she said she wants to leave a boyfriend. And then she wants to be healed and get married in the church. I said, sorry, sister. I'm not the one who say you want to leave. Decide. She went there and said, okay, I don't want this boyfriend. And I want to be healed of HIV. I want to marry right. I said, I will pray only after you have done what you said. She went to the brother, brother, sorry, I'm HIV positive, I don't want to live this life, I want to marry, I want to get married in the right way. She, she was meaning it, she came. Not long she gave a testimony here. After that she came to the office, I said, okay, now you are healed now. T touch her, she went to test, HIV is gone. The issue is faith. <laughs> the issue is what? Can I get someone, for example, let me just show it by pastors, leaders here, who want a car, just want a car, a one person. Stop there, you guys, stop there. Look at these people here. Even if they are not prayed for, because their hearts are open, the anointing will touch them. So these people here now, when they give testimony, you'll be surprised. Let me get the last one here. Who want, sorry, stop there, I didn't say anything. I want someone, I want someone here, you people here, who want a car, one person. Stop there, stop, stop, stop. Look, look at these people, look at them. Look at all of them. Look at this one. Look, look how she's running, the demon inside doesn't want it to move forward. Come back. Booya. One, two, three, come back in Jesus' name. Look at the lady there. The moment she approached me here, the demon face, I said, hey, this man want to give her a card, you know. It's possible. Let me get one person, the last person here. Who want a car here? All right, this brother now, this brother got it now. 
Oh, brother, you don't take someone's car. <laughs> but you got it. You, you have your own now. Go and sit down. you get soon. So this, I'm doing this to teach you so that you understand that things of God, you must not take them very light. I'm sure you understand that. How many of you have learned something today? You have learned something. Don't take things of God how? So like you are losing. Okay, let me just get the, the last pastor who wants his church to grow. Brother, you don't have a church. <laughs> you people, brother, your church will grow. Your church will grow in Jesus' name. Amen. Let me get the last pastor. Let me get one pastor of charities who want to prophesy. One pastor of, of charities. You see? Oh, Brother Mike. Let me get another pastor from Charis who want to prophesy. Hey. hey look here, sir. Look here. Let me hear one pastor of Charis here who want to have a gift of healing. Stop there. You're a pastor of Charis. <laughs> so you people here, you are, you are anointed. You people here, you pray for the people who are sick, they will be healed. Let me get one pastor there who want to receive a gift of healing. Stop there, stop there. All of you receive it in Jesus' name. Look at them. Look at these pastors. Look at all of them. Take it. You are anointed. Can you see? It's easy to pray for you. Let me get one brother here or sister who want to be a millionaire here. Hey, stop. Stop. Oh. Oh. Fall down, all of you. You are anointed.